We asked students 21 questions to get to know them, their program, and their experience at Salis University. Here's what they had to say. What's your name? My name is Robin. Where are you from? Quakertown, Pennsylvania. What program are you in? Uh, occupational therapy. Why did you want to pursue this career? Ooh, uh, just to help people um, give back and make a difference. Why did you choose Salis? The small community. Um, I went to Temple for undergrad and it was such a big school. I wanted something more tight-knit, um, more of a family feel. What have you discovered about your subject area as a grad student that you wish you knew as an undergrad student? Everything. So for undergrad, I went to business school. So um, nothing to do with occupational therapy, but um, I kind of discovered it by being in physical therapy and seeing other OTs work. So just being introduced to it in undergrad would have been fantastic or high school or anything like that. What do you feel is unique about your program at Salus? The number of fieldwork experiences we get and having professors that are actually OTs that are practicing. What clinical experience has made an impact on you thus far at Salus? I have not had any clinical experiences this far. Have you had any discouraging or especially triumphant moments in the classroom or clinic? Um, so this year it's mostly virtual. Um, I'm in my second semester, but we did go last semester in for labs. So having a live cadaver, or not a live cadaver, a cadaver um, lab was really interesting and in seeing the anatomy in person. What's been your favorite class so far? Probably that anatomy class, um, the unique aspect of having the cadaver and, and applying knowledge in real life, it's really cool. Have you had any eureka moments in a classroom or clinic? Yeah, definitely. Um, in some of my classes, just hearing the stories that my professors tell about their, their experiences in the clinic and everything makes me feel validated that I chose this profession. Are you a part of any clubs or groups on campus? Yeah, so um, I am treasurer for the Student Occupational Therapy Association um, and vice president for student council um, for my class. What's your favorite study snack? Ooh, yes, Ben and Jerry's um, ice cream, any flavor is my favorite. What's your study strategy? Just keeping up with it, not letting it get ahead of you um, and not waiting till the week of to start studying for exams. Where's your favorite spot to study on campus? Like I said, I um, haven't been on campus that much, but definitely the courtyard area with the fountains and the gazebos. It's beautiful out there and very calming and relaxing. What advice would you offer a peer who might be struggling in a specific subject or class? Definitely reach out to your peers and um, professors. Professors want to help. They want to see you succeed. So um, don't be shy and speak up. How have you felt supported as a student and an individual while enrolled at Salus? Very supported. Like I said, the professors want you to succeed. Um, this isn't like business school where you're competing with each other. Um, you're a group, you're a family, and you're getting through it together. Where's your favorite place to chill between classes, on campus, or in the community at large? Um, I love hiking and, and trails and parks. Um, so just finding any place to walk, walk around with friends or my dog. How has going virtual impacted your learning experience? It really hasn't. Um, the teachers and professors have done an incredible job of transferring all of our content online, making sure it still meets all criteria um, for our learning, and um, ensuring that we have the support in case we need help or need to slow down on our extra study sessions or whatnot. What's the first thing you want to do once the pandemic is over? Travel again, probably take a big vacation somewhere. What advice would you offer an undergrad considering pursuing an advanced degree in this field? Definitely speak to OTs, um, get their experiences, start shadowing. Um, once you see the impact it makes, you'll fall in love with it um, and you won't regret it. To learn more about Salus University's programs, visit salus.edu slash academics.